Hi, I'm LJ Allen, and this is my final reflection for EDM 310. Um, I've learned a lot in this class. I've really learned to manage my time better. I've always been a bit of a procrastinator, and even though I still need to work on that, I feel like this class has really helped me um, get used to not putting things off until the last minute. Um, I'm more of an independent learner now, and I feel like I ta I'm taking away a lot from this class, and it's not just memorizing things for a test. And like Dr. Strange says, Burke back education. I feel like I'm not doing that anymore. I feel like I was able to like get all the assignments and projects done by myself without much instruction, and that you know that just feels good to get things done right and not have to. You know, obviously I had to ask questions, but I feel like I'm more of an independent learner. Um, Google Drive has been really helpful, and it's um, really easy to like collaborate on projects. And I thought it was really cool to learn how to use that. And um, I've created my PLN on Symbolu, um, and I have a list of all these websites that I can use and people I can contact for my, um, for my academic and professional career as a teacher, and I feel like um, having that is really going to help me out when I get stuck and I need help. Um, I've learned that Twitter is not just a social tool, and it can also used to be, be used for research. And that's uh, a majority of the people that I have to contact on my PLN or on Twitter as well. Some of them have blogs, but most of them um, I follow on Twitter. Like every assignment that we did that we had to tweet someone and thank them, I followed that person. So now like, I have a personal Twitter account, but I also created a Twitter account specifically for EDM310. And I'm going to use it as like my professional Twitter. And I have been, you know, keeping up with people to follow so that I can ask them questions if I need to. Um, I feel like I'm much more familiar with Blogger now. I had a personal blog before this class, but I feel like learning how to do the HTML, besides just, you know, clicking the little button that says link and video and all that, like, it's really um, nice to know how to do that in case I ever needed those skills, just to know those codes and things like that. Um, I feel like um, I've gotten a lot better at working in groups because we had to do like two or three group projects in this class and I feel like I was better at holding up my end of things and not being, you know, like, because I'm usually always either like the leader that takes charge of the group and does basically everything or I'm just like kind of there, not really, I mean I'll do whatever you ask me to but I'm, I feel like I was a lot better at evenly, you know, like our group evenly distributed all the um, duties and things that we had to do and I feel like I am better at working with other people now. It's always a good skill to have. Um, I feel like my intellectual trail, like when you type in my name, all my stuff from this class is going to pop up and I feel like it's something to be proud of and that I did a really good job um, acting professionally. I think that I have learned to act more like a prospective educator than uh, just a student through this class. Um, <clears throat> uh, I do feel like um, a lot of the videos and uh, blog posts that we read were really helpful. I feel like I'm more um, in tune with technology and I feel like I would be interested in uh, including that in my classroom in the future. Um, I've always been a fan of like kind of like a hybrid course where you have like most of some of it's done online and some of it's done in class. And I feel like that's going to be something that I'm going to want to do in my classroom. Um, I'm going to use, I'm going to try to have like a smart board and I want my kids to blog. I think that blogging is a really good way to um, get your work out there and I feel like uh, students really appreciate getting feedback from people that aren't just like their teacher or their classmates. Like, because, you know, other people can read your blog. If you put it up, it's out there. And I feel like commenting is good, too, because it's, like, constructional criticism. And it's not just, you know, like, you know, we watched that video about, like, Picky Patty and, and Mean Maggie. I mean, I don't remember their names, but, I mean, I feel like it, I've learned a lot how to give constructive criticism better, too, and not just be like, oh, you know, you spelled this wrong, that's not correct grammar, like looking at the positive aspects of people's blogs and with people doing that to me too, I feel like I've learned how to better correct mistakes that I've made and um, 
I just really feel like I'm taking a lot away from this class and I've had a really good time. I spent a lot of time on my work. I'm proud of what I did. And um, I feel like I'm not going to advocate uh, Burt Peck education in my class. I feel like I'm going to be a better teacher from taking this class.